Hello students, welcome to my channel. In this session, we will look at a previous CAT question. In fact, it's a question on numbers. Here comes the question. Can you please pause the video, make an attempt and then continue watching this. Right. N the set of natural numbers is partitioned into subsets of S1, S2, S3, S4 and so on. The question is the sum of the elements of the subset S50 is we need some of the elements of this S50. Now, if you look at S1 has got one element in it, that is the first natural number. S2 has got two elements, which are the next two natural numbers. S3 has got three elements. S4 has four elements. So, S50 will have how many elements in this subset? There will be 50 elements. But then, what these 50 elements will be? What it starts with? If you look at S1 has one, as the first natural number, S2 has the next two natural numbers, S3 has the next three natural numbers, S4 has the following four natural numbers, S5 will have the next five natural numbers. So like this, S49 will have the following 49 natural numbers. So why we need this is if you can identify the last element of S49, so we can say S50 is first element. Now, one element here, two elements here, three elements, four elements and S49 has 49 elements means all these subsets together will have how many elements in all? It will be sum of these 1 plus 2 plus 3 up to 49. Is it not sum of first n natural numbers? Sum of first n natural numbers sigma n equals to n into n plus 1 by 2, 49 into 50 by 2, 225, 49, 25, 12, 25. So, they will have 12, 25 elements. If they are 12, 25 elements starting from obviously one means the last element of this 49th subset will be 1, 2, 2, 5. If the last element of 49th subset is 12, 25 for S50 subset, the first element will be 12, 26, next 12, 27 and so on. We have to write 50 numbers. 50 elements, so it will end with 1275. 1226 to 1275, including 1226, there will be 50 el elements. Or you can see the last set here ends with 1225. 50 more elements means this subset should end with 1275. Right. Now we need some of all these 15 elements. If you see, they are 1226 plus 1227 and so on. It's like it's like an arithmetic progression because they are, there is a common, because they are consecutive integers, they are natural numbers, there is a common difference of 1. Hence, sum of n numbers in arithmetic progression is n by 2 into a plus l. This is the formula. n is the number of elements, a is the first number, l is the last number. If I apply this formula here, so sum of this uh, S50 sum will be 50 by 2 into a the first element that is 1226 plus the last element 1275. It will be 225. You can see 25 into 75 plus 26, 101, 2501. So it will be 25, 25, 625 followed by 25. 625, 25 is my answer that is choice D. So this question, if you look at it's it's a simple concept of sum of first n numbers are sum of n numbers in arithmetic progression. But the way this question is given, it makes an interesting uh, study. Thank you.